So my bag's getting a little messy. So, so I figured I might as well do a what's in my bag video while I clean it. So first thing I have is my wallet. It's just black with white polka dots. I think I got this from Claire's. And then in here I just have, you know, cards, money, these things from Dave and Buster's. Uh, Dave and Buster's opened in like one of the towns next to mine and we went there when it opened and I have all these leftover cards because they just kept giving them out and I'm like, no, please, please stop giving these to me. I, I just, I want to use them and leave, but I didn't even get a chance to use all of them because I had so many and I don't ever plan on going back, so I don't know what I'm going to do with these. Um, so that's pretty much all that's in my wallet. Next are my glasses. Yes, I am supposed to wear glasses. I don't really as much as I probably should, but so this is what they look like. I'm not going to put them on. Honestly, I only need them to see like really teeny tiny writing really far away. So that's why I don't wear them like all the time. And only one of my eyes actually needs like a corrective lens. Like the other one is pretty much a fake lens. My glasses. Um, so this is a bow that actually goes on the outside of my bag. I should probably put that back on. Oh, by the way, my bag, I should probably show you that. So this is a white heart quilted print bag from Betsy Johnson. And I got this online because I just, I don't know, I had like a vision of the bag I wanted and obviously it looked just like this and I had such a hard time finding it. I found something similar in Macy's by Betsy Johnson, but it was like in black and like ivory and I really wanted white and I finally found this one. I think it was like on eBay or something. I couldn't even tell you how much I paid for it because I don't remember. I think if I had to take a guess, it'd be around 40 to 60, which is not too bad considering some of the other bags I used to wear. Okay, so the bow was supposed to go in this little zipper thing, and I put it back there, so hopefully it stays there. Alright, next, I have this little card holder, because not all my cards fit in my wallet. I got this card holder from PAX East. It says Pillars of Eternity on it. I'm assuming that's a game, video game of some sort, I don't know. Never played it. And I just have like random like store cards in here, like DSW, Sephora, whatever. Anything that wouldn't fit in my wallet goes in there. Uh, next, I have a lock de-icer because I live in New England and it gets pretty dang cold in the winter. I've never actually had to use this, but you never know. So always keep this handy. I have some earplugs. I always wear earplugs when I sleep. And this started when I was in college because I lived in the party dorm and it was pretty noisy at night and I could not sleep. So I started wearing earplugs now. I've been wearing them ever since. So I always keep a pair in my bag just in case I am traveling and I forget to pack them. It's like a nightmare. So I always keep some in my bag just in case as a backup. Nail file, because if I don't have a nail file, then I start to peel my nails. If they chip, I start peeling them and it's just awful and so I always keep a nail file so I can like avoid ruining my nails. Ah. So this is a bag full of all my lip products. I always just keep a bunch of lip products in my bag because that's usually like the only thing I touch up throughout the day. This bag is from an Ipsy. When I used to get Ipsy, I don't get Ipsy anymore, but there's a ton of stuff in here. I can show you what's in here. So a bunch of lip liners. So we got this Rimmel East End Snob. Love this one. I actually think I pretty much 
yeah, there's only a teeny left. That's all that's left. Use that a ton. Then I have Milani Color Statement Lip Liner in Hot Pink. Hot Pink. And I have three Sephora like little mini lip liners in Funky Fuchsia, Lovely Lilac, and Cute Caramel or Caramel. And then I pretty much have a lip product to go with each of those lip liners. So I've got an e.l.f. Jumbo Gloss Stick in Flirty and Girly. I have a Revlon Jumbo Lip. This is like the matte one in Elusive. I have Lipstick by Dose in 907 because it doesn't have a name, it's just a number. NYX Butter Gloss in Apple Strudel. I don't really feel like the name really fits because it's kind of like a coral color and I don't really think of coral when I think of Apple Strudel. Well, I don't know. A Pop Beauty Lip Gloss in Fuchsia Freesia. Elf Lipstick in Runway Pink. Again, I don't feel like the name really fits because I think this is more of a nude. A pink, not even really a nude pink. It is pretty much straight up nude, like a tan nude. I use this with the, and I even use this with the cute caramel beauty company skipping to see names. I don't know. Then last but not least, I have a, uh, da -da -da -da, what is this? Clinique. There we go. Clinique lipstick in Shy, and this is a sheer lipstick, so it's not that crazy. Oh, I wish it was. So those are all the lip products I carry around with me. Those, these are the ones I typically wear most of the time. I have two almost pretty much empty pocket back hand sanitizers from Bath and Body Works. I mean, I don't really typically use hand sanitizers unless I'm at work because when I'm at work, so I work in fashion and Sometimes people are trying on shoes, and if I'm touching the shoes they're trying on, I always want to use hand sanitizer because some people's feet are not that dirty. I have a change purse. Yes, I'm an old lady and I carry a change purse because my wallet is flat. I can't fit change in here. If I try to put it in here, it won't close. So, change purse. Yes, I keep it in here. I don't like change. I usually always just give it to someone because I hate change and I honestly. Like, I don't use change and I don't use cash because cash is dirty and gross and I'm always paranoid that I'm going to lose it or it's going to get lost or stolen or whatever. So I just, like, never carry, like, physical money around with me. I just always use cards and change purse. I got this also from Claire's forever ago. It's really cute. I have a chapstick, or, I'm sorry, chap aid lip balm from... Walgreens. It's just like a generic Walgreens brand in the flavor cherry. Not the best lip balm I've ever used, but it does, you know, it works. Gets the job basically done. Okay, got tons of pens because I'm a pen hoarder, apparently. Just like I see a nice pen and I'm like, oh, I gotta, I gotta carry that around with me. So pens out of the wazoo, and I have a little sharpie, ultra fine point thing. I have a spare key to my car with a whistle attached to it. I have this tub of Eclipse gum that spilt in my bag, and now it's everywhere. They're everywhere. I actually don't even really like gum. I usually use just mints, like when I'm at work, because I'm. At work, I do a lot of talking. Talk, 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 talk. So, you need to have nice breath if you're gonna be talking a lot to a lot of people. So, I usually always use mints, but um, my, my mom, I ran out, and I asked my mom to just grab me some while she was at the store. She came back with gum. I mean, it's fine, I, I use them anyway. I just, but, you know, prefer mints. Oh, and a bobby pin. Close change and a bobby pin. 
All right, so that's everything that was in the main compartment. I do have a little zipper pocket right here where I keep my tampons and pads because I'm a girl and girls need those types of things, so it'll stay there. Then I have a little front pocket right here where I have a map to the local mall near me because I actually don't even really go to the mall all that often. I really actually do all of my shopping online mostly because it's more convenient for me because I'm very busy and always on the go and I don't, oh, what else is in here? don't really have time to go shopping but the mall, the stores are always changing like ridiculous. So I always have to have, like grab one of the maps so I can know where I'm going. Not that I really go there that often, but probably out of date. But that's in the front pocket. And there's also one other thing in the front pocket. I have a little perfume, English Laundry number no. seven. I'm actually not the hugest fan of this scent. It's like it's not bad. It's borderline manly, which I don't I don't mind. I don't mind manly scents, but. I don't know. Usually I'm not a cute, I'm not picky when it comes to perfume, but this one, meh. And you know, I just keep it in here just in case I forget to put something on before I leave the house. So that stays in there. And that's everything in my bag. And now it's all nice and clean.